What it do, y'all? It's your boy P1 back in here again, and welcome to another GTA 6 video, guys. Today, we got some information, just a couple things that I want to talk about. It's a little different this time, something that we need on GTA 6. And um, for most guys, make sure you guys go ahead and drop, kick that like, subscribe to the channel. You know, we're trying to hit that 22k, and that's the sub goal for this channel. And make sure you turn the bells on. Now, for some information, y'all, let's go ahead and dive in. So, you heard what happened today. We got this tweet that popped up and it was shocking, but hey man, we understand it. It says, we have decided to postpone the PlayStation 5 event scheduled for June 4th. While we understand gamers worldwide are excited to see PS5 games, we do not feel that right now is the time for celebration. And for now, we want to stand back and allow more important voices to be heard. Damn, that is sad in a way, but at the same time, we must understand that we're in the world right now. We got some issues. And, you know, we want to watch this at peace without having some negativity going on in the background, you know what I'm saying? So, I understand PlayStation, uh, how they're trying to get this, you know, on a perfect day, on a perfect Sunday day, man, trying to give us the information on the games and the PS5, too. And now to put that on the site, guys, now we have this interior that we want to talk about, an open interior. Now, imagine, outside of the clothing stores, strip clubs, homes of, you know, these three protagonists, but I don't know, it could be two or one. Imagine no interior in GTA 5 was accessible outside of a specific missions that can lead to like the feelings of the world being obviously closed off and everything. But in detailed games, these worlds are actually great. But this lack of interiors that has on GTA 5, we're trying to get GTA 6 to get some pointers from, you know, maybe Mafia 3, you know, have an accessible interiors that can actually have both designs and NPCs present. You know, without, you know, interactions and with buildings in the world, which can be just, you know, talked about later on. But it's important that, you know, the players explore the whole world in full, you know what I'm saying? So if this amount has like a lot of open buildings and stores that you can actually rob, at least there's a clear upgrade you know what I'm saying? Like Heist, it was the best one of all, but you know, in GTA. But with more armed robberies, dynamic side event opportunities, you know, like those unknown ones like uh, Red Dead as well, and then better overall experience that we can actually see, you know what I'm saying? We need stuff like this, something open. We need some kind of malls, but at the same time, at the same dang time, we want to have you know, just interiors in every single section. And, you know, let's just say if it's Vice City or, you know, wherever this map's gonna be. But I'm pretty sure it's gonna be Vice City. But imagine going to a normal location as a business, saloons, or sorry, salons. And then, you know, a pair of doors that actually open from, you know, let's just say you wanna go jog into a place and just walk in there and just have an appropriate thematic for reasons, you know what I'm saying? But imagine enjoying the game to actually walk into buildings that you want to walk into feel alive, you know what I'm saying? That's just some things that I want to, you know, I want in the game. I'm pretty sure you guys do. But let me know if you guys think about that in the comment section, man. All right, so now we have image leaks and debunks, okay? Now here are a few guys. People are looking at this picture and claiming this is GTA 6. You guys put in the comment section, let me know what this image is from. Because uh, people are just claiming that it's, 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 it's GTA 6. And if you look at this one right here, guys, who are making these? I mean, they're great pictures, you know what I'm saying? But come on, GTA 6? What is the deal with people? What's wrong with this girl? The bloody pop, man. What's she doing? Anyways, man, it's, here's another one right here, guys, okay? It's something that's really strange. A PlayStation 2 with GTA with the 5 logo and the 6 on it? Man, what is this guy, like some kind of side gig trying to make a little extra money in your pockets? Well, I don't know what, what that is, man. This It's really odd. It's just been going around lately. But, you know, it is what it is, man. People want to get hyped in their own way. That's just that. It's just very odd seeing these things around. But make sure, man, y'all go ahead and chop a comment, guys. Let me know what you guys actually think about this image, this debunk, just, ev just everything else, okay? Including the PS5 and stuff. And um, also, guys, I did make a Facebook, which is for GTA 6 groups. So if you guys want to join it, it'll be in the description as well. It's brand new. Just make sure you go and check it out. 
And, um, you know, I just made it for, you know, everybody else who's uh, loving GTA stuff. Make sure you guys do subscribe for future GTA 5 and GTA 6 info videos, guys. Y'all know what we have it here first. The one and only P1, man. But just, I don't know. These images is crazy, man. Other than that, make sure to tune in for more videos, okay? We ain't going to stop. We're going to keep going, talk about different, you know, um things and you know including for gta 6 today guys y'all take it easy guys you already know who it is boy p1 signing out